What's going on guys? It's your boy Maximum RPM coming at you with another video today. And I'm thinking that this is a mod for just Metal Fight Bays, because I haven't found a driver yet that this will fit on. But I'm going to go through an assortment of drivers today to test this theory out, because I think it'd be really cool. Now, everyone knows my Metal Fight Bay lost long enough somehow it's got that huge gaping hole for a performance tip. In fact, I have it right here. Just this big open hole like that. It's kind of like Giga Flat. I'm going to show you how to make any wide tip work. So, when you guys go to the dentist, they usually send you home with a bag of stuff. They'll send me home with one of these little flossy things. So... What you need is actually inside. So what you can do is just... Holy cow, that's a lot of strength. Still going. Alright. Now I'm dropping things. So now that we have all of the floss out of there, what we can do now is... Separate the two parts. Be careful with this little metal part there. I like to bend the tab down. But what you want are... These little rollers. In fact, that closes right back up. Individual rollers. Forgot to turn my light on. So, I find the best thing to do this with is this performance tip. It's not a uh, wide defense, but it's a little bit smaller. So, what you're going to do is take one of these little rollers and just push it on. This one's kind of loose. Hold on. Let me get my Hades Destroyer. And it just kind of firmly slides on, not coming off, sleep stands, very, it makes it a bit taller, um, and the best part is you can do it with two bay blades if you have another one, and it almost fits on this, which is the performance tip that comes on Medio El Drago, it almost fits, it's a little small. It does not fit on the wide ball. Um, but as you can see, it works very well with this. It's kind of loose on this one. The only one that it really fits good is Hades Destroyer. Um, and I think that's about the only one that it really works with. But we don't need to talk about that. <laughs> Um, and I think it fits, yeah, it fits on Massive. Gotta apply quite a bit of pressure, though. It shouldn't damage Massive, but... Ugh. <laughs> it just popped off. Um, so... If you guys are into modifying stuff and, like, actually cutting stuff apart or gluing things, this will definitely work with Massive if you get some glue. Okay, so, firmly grasp it! Okay. This would work if I had... If I didn't want to ruin my Massive driver, I'd glue it if it fits on Unite. It does not. This is the problem that I was having before. So, it doesn't... Hold on a second. It, it'll fit on loop, but it won't stay on. I'm finding that it fits on just about everything, but it won't stay on. Um, ooh. Ooh. It almost works with Quake. It works on Fusion. It does indeed work on Fusion. So let's make a quick combo to test. Um, let's do... Wyvron, Spread, Ultimate Unite. 
Yeah, I'll call it Ultimate Unit. You no, know, you know what? Let's go with Wyvern Six Meteor Unite. Ultimate Unite. And I will test both of these out right now. So I have my BB10 Stadium right here. Uh, where'd everything go? So let's test out this Wyvron against. Let's put it up against Doom Sizer 6 Vortex Quake. See, it's already taken one hit. Wow, that actually looks pretty cool. Come on, guys. Fight each other. As you can see, it performs just like a normal fusion driver. And it wins with a spin finish. So now we attach our mod to it. Okay. Oh, well. And we will put it up against the same Beyblade. First of all, let's do a quick spin test. That was a very, very soft launch. I just want to make sure that it doesn't fly off when I actually do my regular launch, so this should work. Well, it kind of flew off. I'm going to need to go get another one of those. This might even work on Excel. There seems to only be about one good one in the whole bunch. I think it I think it would work on an Excel, maybe. The one the ones that I've left don't seem to fit, but let's see if it'll stay on this time. Ow. I just knocked a Beyblade off the table and it landed on my foot. That hurt. Once again, guys, this is just kind of a weird video doing some experiments. Where did I put the Beyblade? There it is. Of course, I finally get everything working right, and I can't find a stupid Beyblade. All right, here we go. Third time's the charm. And it fell off. Just going to push it back on and do a... As you can see when it stays on... It's very aggressive. Let me see if I can get a good battle in. Very hard to control. Um, doesn't really stay on that well. But if you are into doing mods where you have to glue things to each other then, by all means, this mod will work 100%. Now let's do a metal fight. Okay, so this is... Oh my god, I can't find anything today. So this is a worn-out version of the performance tip that it's already on. So it's a little bit aggressive, but mostly it's just going to sit in the center. As you guys know, that Herculeo does. Now, the modded performance tip. These things are just going all over the place and love knocking things off my table. <laughs> Next time I should have a relatively clean table, because so far all it's done is just race across and knock things off my table. <laughs> so, let me grab my other stadium. Here we go. Now I won't be knocking things off my table constantly. Um, so let's just put Destroyer up against a relatively decent bay that has kind of a weak defense, Flame Cetus. Super aggressive. It's got a lot of aggression. But it has no stamina. So let's have the mod fight itself. Here we go. And 
just realized I only have one of these launchers. I'm a little out of practice with putting two on, one after another. For a proper test, I'm going to... I have my second launcher here, so let's try this just one more time. Well then, as you can see, this can still fall off, but it makes the Beyblade so much taller, and it just kills the stamina. Um... I wish I could say that I was good at mod videos, but I'm not into taking my stuff apart. <laughs> Still dropping things. Alright guys, later today I plan on having a really good video out. Um, probably a skit. Um, I'm either going to make a skit today or I'm going to do a mod for my RC car. Um, yeah. By the way, you know how everyone calls Kivo um, the putty god? He's also the mod god, because he makes the most amount of mods. Alright guys, that is about it. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I doubt anyone's going to leave a like on this video, except for my mother. <laughs> Alright guys, this was so bad. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I hope this video made your day just a little bit better. Live life to the max and stay awesome.